In the name of Allah, who is the most compassionate and the most merciful, dear students, ladies and gentlemen, I hope that you are fine and healthy and have a good life with your family. This is Rajasthan University, Faculty of Computer Science and Photic English for Computer User. And today we will study Unit 1. The title of this unit is Living in a Digital Age. Uh, your instructor is Pahanyar Ali Muhammad Hikmat, year 2020. In this slide, we will see the title, The Digital Age. Match the caption 1 up to 4 with the picture A to D. Here we have 1, 2, 3, 4 and here we have some blanks. You can write A here, for example, D here and C and after that like this. Look at the picture and read these uh, sentences and find which picture match with these captions. Okay, the first caption in education computer can make all the differences. The second one using a, a cash point or ATM. The third one, the internet in your f pocket. And the fourth one, control air traffic. Uh, you can do it by yourself, very easy. Here we have a text passage, uh, which I would like to read it for you. And you should listen. And uh, if it is not visible or it is not clear, uh, you cannot see it, then go to your book and see uh, passage 1, text 1. The digital age. The title of this passage is the digital age. Listen to the reading of text and then read it with yourself. Less the difficult word that you don't know. You are now, uh, this is the reading section. You are now living in what some people call the digital age, meaning that computers have become an essential uh, part of our lives. Young people who have grown up with PCs and mobile phones are often called the digital generation. Computer help students to perform mathematical operations and improve their math skills. They are used to access the internet to do basic research and to communicate with other students around the world. Teacher use projectors and interactive uh, whiteboard to give presentation and teach sciences, history and language courses. PCs are also used for administrative purposes. Uh, schools use word processor to write letters and database to keep record of students and teachers. A school website allows teachers to publish exercise for students to complete online. And the continuation of this reading, a student can also uh, enroll for courses via the website and, and parents can download official reports. Mobile let you make uh, voice call, send text, email, uh, people and uh, people and download logos, uh, email people and download logos. Ringtones are games uh, with a built or built-in camera. You can send picture and make video call and face-to-face -face mood. New uh, smartphone combine a telephone with web access, video. A games, uh, a games control, uh, an MP3 player, a personal digital assistant P or PDA, and uh, a GPS navigation system all in one. In banks, computer store information about the money held by each customer and enable staff to access large database and to carry out financial transaction at high speed. They also control the cash point or ATM, uh, it, uh, automatic teller machine, uh, which uh, dispenses money to customer by the use of PIN protection, uh, protected card. People use a chip and PIN card uh, or PIN card to pay 
for goods and uh, services and instead of using a signature to verify payment customer are asked to uh, enter a four digit uh, personal identification card p pen or pen number p p stand for personal i stand for identification and n for number the same number used at cash points this uh, system make transaction more secure with online banking clients can easy pay bills and transfer money from the, the comfort of their homes oh, okay in airline pilots use computer to help them control the plane for example monitor display data about fuel consumption and weather condition in airport control tower computers are used to manage radar system and regulate air traffic on the on the ground airline are connected to travel agencies by computer travel agents use computer to find out about the availability of flight price times stop over and many other details okay in this slide find the word 1 up to 10 see 1 up to 10 in the box above can you guess the meaning of uh, the meaning from context it means that you you should see here make call syntax for example like this uh, and think about the meaning of the word uh, from this uh, context and uh, here we have uh, uh, are they nouns verb adjective or adverb write n for example if it is if it is n uh, write n here if it is v write v uh, verb if it is uh, adjective uh, write adg and uh, uh, here we have another uh, very easy point line number six you can see here line number five this is line number six perform and you can find very easy the word here match the words in d uh, one up to ten here up to here and with the correct meaning a to g a to g okay uh, for example keep or save this one is a store you can do it by yourself as a homework what do we have here here we have a help box the grammar section uh, we we will study collocation the definition of collocation is that when verbs and nouns often go together in English to make set of phrase are called collocation. This is uh, the definition of collocation. Example for coll learning collocation instead of individual verb can help you remember which verb to use with which noun. This is the significant point for collocation. If you if you I just memorize the individual word that is not uh, useful uh, and if you if you memorize uh, the word with a word before and a word after that then you can use it in different contexts okay these are the examples perform operation and this perform is verb and operation is noun. syntax the same is store information access the internet do research display data complete exercise make call write letters carry out transaction do the exercise on language work for location one unit one page 14 of your page four of your book in your book here in this slide we have a listening section uh, this listening section is in page 4 unit 1 click on loudspeaker symbol in the corner of this slide and listen to the sound and fill in the card for example if I click here uh, at the corner here I see you can see 
the symbol of uh, the symbol of loudspeaker and I click here Let's unit this. one task three speaker one I write music mainly for videos and plays I work on a keyboard connected to a computer you can listen up to the end of up to the end of this listening point and fill these uh, table and you have these words uh, at the box and you can use it here okay listen again and write what each speaker use uses their computer for okay do this exercise as well and uh, after that we have um, a useful we have useful language here is uh, the guide or exercise that we should do it uh, write a paragraph about one of the bold topic and use the word from a useful language box here we have writing section and these are the topics uh, formula one course entertainment uh, factories and industrial process school and universities these are the words that you can use them in your paragraph design and build a car test virtual module control electronic components uh, monitor engine speed uh, if you don't know any 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 of the words please look at your dictionary okay here we have an example uh, formula one uh, computer we can we can write like this computer are used to design and build racing cars and test virtual module computer help module models computer help engineer to design the car body and the, and the mechanical parts during during races a lot of micro uh, process processor control the electronic components of the car and monitor the engine speed temperature and other vital information these are all about unit one if you have any question any suggestion any comments please contact with me i gave you my my email address as well as my mobile number and i am available here thanks from your attention